this is Anil with a video tutorial for the learning layer on C programming. So in this video tutorial we are going to see the ternary operators in C. So these ternary operators are used as uh, another alternative for you know the if and else. So first let's see the syntax. So I am going to copy and paste it. So this is the syntax of this ternary operator. So first we need to write the expression 1 and a question mark then the expression 2 then a colon and then expression 3 so here if this expression 1 is true then this expression 2 is evaluated and the value of this expression 2 will become the value of this whole expression then if this expression 1 is false then this expression 3 is evaluated and the value of this expression 3 will become the value of this whole expression so first for the demonstration purpose we can uh, uh, use a condition in this expression 1 we can form the condition using relational and uh, you know logical operators so first we are gonna use a variable let's call it age and I'm gonna assign it with the value of 20 so now we're gonna write this expression 1 in this tutorial this expression 1 is going to be a condition so we are going to form a condition using the relational operator here if you want to construct a complex condition then you, you can use this logical operator also so I am going to write age greater than or equal to 18 whether my age is greater than or equal to 18 then the question mark if this expression evaluates to true then I want to execute this expression 2 so here this expression 2 is going to be a printf statement and I'm going to say you are adult. So make a note that we are not adding a semicolon here. So next we need to add a colon as you can see here after this expression 2. Then we need to write the expression 3. So this expression 3 will be executed if this expression 1 is false. So here it's going to be another printf statement and we're gonna say you are minor so after this expression 3 we need to add a semicolon so add it here so here what happens is it's gonna check whether my age is greater than or equal to 18 so if this expression evaluates to true then this printf statement will be executed so this printf statement is gonna return the number of characters it has printed to the screen so in this case it has printed 13 characters so this printf statement is going to return a value 13 so that 13 is going to be the value of this whole expression so if you want you can save that value by using a variable and an assignment operator but in this case we are not saving that value so we're just printing you are adult to the screen if this condition is true similarly if this condition is false we are printing you are minor to the screen so I'm gonna save it compile and run so as you can see since my age is equal to 20 which is greater than or equal to 18 it says you are an adult so I'm gonna make this less than uh, 18 let's say 16 save compile and run so as you can see it says you are a minor so I'm gonna close it so while explaining the syntax I told that you know if this expression 1 is true then uh, this expression 2 will be executed and the value of this expression 2 will be the value of this whole expression similarly if this expression 1 is false then expression 3 will be executed and uh, the value of this expression 3 will be the value of this whole expression so to demonstrate that I'm gonna um, comment this out and I'm gonna write so let's say age equal to 16 and we need another variable let's say int x so what we wanna do is we're gonna check whether this age is greater than or equal to 18 if it is so we want to return the value of 1 so if this age is greater than or equal to 18 we're gonna return 1 and if this age is uh, not greater than or equal to 18 let, let's say this age is less than 18 then we're gonna return a value of 0 so we're gonna assign the value 
1 or 0 depending on this condition and we're going to store it in this variable x that's why it's going to be x equal to age is greater than or equal to 18 if it is so we're going to return or we want to store the value of 1 in this variable x else we're going to store the value of 0 in this variable x so uh, I'm going to add a uh, parenthesis here I'm going to save it and I'm going to print the value of x it's going to be a printf statement percentage d comma x so I'm going to save it compile it and run it so since my age is 16 which is less than or equal to 18 you know this expression 3 will be the value of this whole expression so it's going to add in this 0 to this variable x that's why we're getting 0 here so I'm going to make this let's say 23 save compile and run so as you can see you know this expression ev evaluated to true that's why this expression 2 is executed and the value of this expression 2 in this case it's just a value of 1 so that will be assigned to this variable x that's why we're getting a value of 1 here so this is it this is about the ternary operators in C so thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe like my facebook page at facebook.com slash learning lad and i see you in the next tutorial